What's up everybody, Grim here. Today we're looking at the Democratic Detonation War Bond that just became available in Helldivers 2. Now, I will be eventually doing a video on the Educator, I'm sorry, Educator, whatever you want to call it, and the Crossbow, but today we're doing it on the R36 Eruptor. With damage at 380, capacity at 5, recoil at 75, a fire rate at 25, medium armor penetration, and explosive, this thing is a menace. It can take out uh, certain objectives like the transmitting illegal broadcast towers. Two, three shots, get them in the direct hit. Whenever you find patrols, the flak explosion on this thing does equally well against bugs as it does bots. It hits like a truck. Unfortunately, you're, you're capped at a capacity of five rounds in a mag. Now that's not necessarily a bad thing because it hits the way it hits. But you need to be mindful about the amount of ammo you're using and your surroundings because you don't want to be too close. This weapon can easily two-shot a guy with the shield and the minigun and it can one-shot most of the, uh, the walkers just fine. The flak damage is superb, but it will hurt you a lot. Long range, medium range. Keep it away from your buddies. As you can see here against the bugs, it will destroy most bugs. One or two hit. Most of the, you know, the little guys. The flak damage, great for clearing out the trash mobs. Hives, direct hit with this weapon, will take out those structures. When I tell you guys that this weapon has taken over as my new favorite primary, I mean it. It doesn't have the ammo capacity I would like. It doesn't fire as fast as I would like. But when you hit those shots, you get past that learning curve of this weapon. I don't think I would describe it as a new meta. It's definitely a very valid support option. You don't need the whole team to run this weapon. And in fact, I don't know if that would be very helpful in the higher difficulties. But as of difficulties 6 and 7, this weapon does wonders. And I'm very happy with it. We'll have to wait and see what levels 8 and 9 look like. This is a huge development in this game, I think. Being able to cause all these little flak-like explosions from a primary weapon. I would hopefully one day like to see more experimentation from the devs on different weapons they'd like to use. I am still very excited to look at this crossbow, so I'm hoping you guys will find that video helpful. If you found this video helpful, please let me know down in the comments. A like, dislike, comment, whatever, what have you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys have your own experiences with this weapon, chime in. I would love to hear it. And tell me what else you think about the Democratic Detonation War Bond package we just got. Alright guys, I'm the Grim Crow, this is GCG, and I will see you in the next one. Later.